First up, we have the Luxury Card Gold. Despite its fancy name and premium look, this card falls flat in almost every meaningful category. The Luxury Card Gold is primarily known for its metal design and luxury branding, which gives it a premium look and feel. For some, the sleek metal design can be a status symbol. However, the positives largely end there. The card comes with a high annual fee of $995, which is extremely high, especially when you consider its reward structure. The Luxury Card Gold offers a low rewards rate of just 1.5% on all purchases. This is significantly lower than what many other premium cards offer. Furthermore, there's no sign-up bonus, which is a major downside. Most premium cards come with substantial sign-up bonuses to attract new customers, but the Luxury Card Gold does not. In addition to the high annual fee and low rewards rate, the card lacks other benefits that are commonly found in premium cards. For example, it doesn't offer travel credits, airport lounge access, or significant purchase protections. These are benefits that many users expect when they're paying a high annual fee. The lack of a sign-up bonus, combined with the low rewards rate and minimal additional benefits, makes it hard to justify the high cost of the luxury card gold. There are many other cards on the market that offer better rewards, lower fees, and more perks. Because of these shortcomings, the Luxury Card Gold goes to Tier D, not recommended. It's a card that might look good in your wallet, but in terms of value and benefits, it falls short compared to the other options available.